Hello and welcome to World of Warcraft Let's Play. Um, I have to first state that this is probably the worst idea I have ever had. Um, I do not enjoy levelling. I um, have only levelled one character all the way to 80 and the other one to 70, which uh, the Druid, my favourite class, and the Warlock, um, which I'm terribly bored of. Um, I chose to do a mage for this uh, Let's Play simply because um, I've heard a lot about the class. I hear it's uh, enjoyable and um, I chose a Draenei because I do not like um, gnomes, I already have a female gnome um, and um, I, I won't do um, male caster classes, all of my um, uh, melee classes are um, male, the Death Knight, the Druid which is Feral um, and the Priest which is a Robert character but that's male and the Paladin are all male, the uh, Warlock, Hunter and uh, shaman and mage are all female. Um, I chose Draenei simply because they're most pleasurable uh, characters to watch from behind. Um, it was either that or human, and I personally don't like the human race. Nothing personal against them. I just don't like them. Um, so um, I'm going to lay down a few ground rules. Um, I will be reading out all of the quest dialogues to help first time players. I will not speed up any footage. I will hopefully be able to keep interesting facts whilst playing the game, and I intend to level this mage 1 to 80 10 minutes at a time, simply because I am that bored, summer has come to an end, and uh, I'm looking for something to do. I'm we'll playing on the Defiance Brotherhood server, um, the character um, of course is a Draenei mage, so uh, let's begin. Uh, I must apologise first if the, uh, there are any frame rate stutters or um, loading screens or anything like that, I'm of course recording it using Crossfire or Xfire on a pretty powerful computer but of course it's obviously has its ups and down times. Um, my voice can get to you, you are not obliged to watch any of the videos, I'm simply going to talk over them, explain what I can. This is intended for mostly first time players or anyone that's simply interested enough. I'm uh, just going to give a, as much information and guide as I can. The add-ons I will be using um, are um, first off the um, the UI, as you may have already noticed, is um, uh, X5. Uh, not X5, sorry, that's the wrong one. It's um, X Pearl. Um, I will start off now. I'll get that thing a lot for some reason. I'll start off now by activating all of the action bars. Um, and uh, always, you want um, always show action bars will be on for me. Um, then again. Um, what else can I say? So uh, let's start with this. So, of course, you do start in Arm and Vellum as a, a Mist Isle. And um, another thing I want to we'll note: I bought the heirloom items, um, the uh, shoulder pads and the chest, with some spare um, emblems on my old one because they upgraded it to um, uh, emblems of conquest, and not emblems of heroism anymore. Um, so, a mage. What can I say about the mage? Uh, all Draenei start off with the gift of the Naru which I'll be moving over here. Um, you get Frost Armor, which is a buff. Activate that. Um, you will get, and you start off with the basic fireball, your first attack. I ran straight past the quest giver, because I was looking at my thing. Um, food and that are on your hotbar, but I'll be moving them up there. And of course you get Cherish Trusty Hearthstone. It is on cooldown, um, because I obviously ran up here to collect my mail. And I ran past them again. I'm completely not paying attention. Um, so I move a lot of items like that onto the uh, hotbar as such. I'm also going to take off melee attack because as a mage you shouldn't need it and the buff I'm going to put over here. So at the moment all we have to do is focus on our attack which is this survival. You survived! Never mind my injury sister, it's a miracle that any of us are alive. It didn't look like you'd pull through, you'd been in suspension for weeks. Something happened and the Exodar crashed, many have died. But I'm relieved that you are alive, Nature. With, your lead with you leading our efforts I'm sure we'll get safety soon. Proenditus asked me to send you him when you were, when you awoke. He is waiting for you at the bottom of the hill. Just follow the path southwest. Speak with Proenditus in the crash site in Amon Bear. Something that we always find uh, amusing is that uh, Burning Crusade came out ooh, January 2007, I believe, and um, they're still finding survivors every day. Uh, another survivor wakes up from its coma, and uh, of course I have. I was over there, nice and asleep. And of course you might never talk to this guy. The quests are highlighted with um, the question mark ones you can hand in. You survived. 
Our immediate concerns depend on the state of our healing crystals and must replenish them quickly. Unfortunately, the only way to do this at the point is to extract the blood from the local veil moss. The blood will make a suitable substitute. Moss can be found in many places around the veil but are mostly concentrated in the northwest. Now, this arrow that just come up here is Quest Helper and it will point me where I need to go. And that's what that is up there. Um, they're the moths and they will also be marked um, if I need them. Um, I'm not going to go kill them just yet. I'm going to run and grab this quest over here and just buy that. Um, zoom out all the way, I've got to do that. Um, yeah, I can tell that reading out all the quests is going to be very difficult. Kill eight volatile mutations and for some reason she wants me to kill volatile mutations. I've already gone on what I want to read because I'm that lazy. So let's start off with this. I'm going to stand just out, of, uh, just in range. Um, you can tell when that is because it will go red and I can go really far back. There we go. Um, so if I shoot from here I should be able to get a few in before he gets to me and there we go. That's how you kill them. You uh, pretty much spam your fireball until they die. And of course I'll be looting all the greys because um, I sell them for money. Let's try uh, completing these quests here. And uh, that was a crit. The big uh, if the number is bigger it's a crit. Um, and there's the vial there. Um, there are some quests where you have to just kill them, I call them kill counts, um, and there are some quests where you have to collect items. Um, the uh, item collecting isn't 100% on all of them. On this it may be because it's a starter quest, but um, it is a uh, it is possible for um, uh, not all of them to have it, which is can get registered especially later on in the game. Um, as you can see there. I have 100% rate at the moment. My mana would deplete. That will also come up. It will tell me I have. Um, oh, there we go. I'm out of mana, which means I'm gonna have to hit him with my stuff. I uh, press the T button, or the T key, uh, to engage melee, and hopefully I won't do that too long. And I can take him out. And there we go. That is a level. I'm now level two. Ding, as they call it in the modern game. And of course, when you level up, you get. Uh, all of your mana and uh, HP replenished, and uh, let the dot kill him. Um, as you'll notice, when I attack uh, any mob, uh, Fireball actually puts on what's called a damage over time or dot. And it does one damage every two seconds, which um, is a uh, obviously that increases as you as you upgrade your ranks. Um, every um, uh, thing down here is um, your experience and your uh, skills. I killed that one quite far away. Um, what else I can really say about the interface and uh, how quests work? I mean, obviously, there's more different, loads of different varieties of quests, but you do start off with the basics go kill this many, bring me back this many of these, and uh, don't ask why. You know, it's very simple, especially at the start of the game. Quests are, you know, just quite linear. Um, I've never finished off a Dwayne Plus level 20 actually, um, which is obviously the starting zone, I'm out of mana again. Um, they, um, they all start off in this area here, which is called Azumist Isle, I, knew, I remember that anyway. Um, press M, your map comes up, right click to expand out of the map. Um, again, I, sh I should drink, but wait, drinking wastes time, attack. Drinking wastes time for me, and it's. Um, Frustrating, especially. I mean, that's one of the reasons I didn't want to have a mana class, because you do have to keep drinking. I mean, I leveled a druid, which is uh, as feral. You work on energy, and that's pretty much um, you know replenishes fast as fast as you can use it. You know, it takes t uh, t ten seconds to replenish from zero. Mana can take a lot longer. Um, I don't know if you can see it um, on the screen. I don't know what you're watching on YouTube or even if I do put it up. But um, every single time. Um, you finish casting a spell. X Pearl has the um, the great technique of um, a little blue line will move underneath your mana. That's five seconds long. Every five seconds after a cast, your mana goes into replenishment um, as though you're out of combat. Um, that's um, judged by your MP5. Every five seconds, you gain so many mana. Um, but um, usually, um, you're actually not likely to reach your five seconds. I mean, it will climb up quite quickly at this low level. But um, unfortunately, later on in levels, you will have to um, drink up quite a lot, which um, can be frustrating, especially for um, speedrunners. Uh, this 
is not a power leveling thing. I'm not going to follow a strict thing. I'm even going to, I'm literally going to play this as a first time player and, um, you know, do quests as I find them, do zones. I'm going to do basic zones and skip zones that I hate because um, this is a PvP, well, an RP PvP server and it's probably very likely that at some point I will be killed. Um, I will give a shout out now to the guild that will probably do it and that will be Realm Walkers. Um, heaven forbid this catches wind of what I'm doing and they spot my little mage and intently hunt me, hunt me down but I've thought about this and if such events do frequently occur I will um, edit down videos. It's coming up to 10 minutes 30 now so I will stop filming this now and then this uh, quest will be complete so let's stop recording now.